Hi there, welcome in. My name is M. I'm going to be your hairstylist for this evening. Did you make it in out of the rain okay? Great, good to hear. Hopefully it calms down by the time we are done with your appointment today and it won't ruin your hair whenever you leave. <laughs> right, so speaking of your hair, what are we thinking about doing today? All right, it's been a while since you've had a haircut. Okay. All right, and we're not sure. That's totally fine. We can take a few moments to figure it out together. Okay. Okay. So, let me see here. So, you've said it's been a while since your last haircut. Do you remember sort of how long? A few months, years, weeks? Okay, all right. Well, that is a long time, but that's okay. That's okay. All right. Seems like your hair texture is, I'd say, medium thickness. But it does um, have some color damage, is that correct? Okay, yeah, your ends definitely um, look like they've had some color work done and I can tell just from the way your hair is sort of laying on your face that it's giving you some grief, is it? pretty hard to style at this point. Yeah, I thought so. thought so. Well, I can definitely do some things to help you with that today. Okay, so no worries. No worries. Are you looking to get more color done at this appointment? Okay, so it's something we'd be interested in in the future. Is that correct? Definitely don't recommend that uh, we put color on it today. I think it's, I, I think it just needs some time to rest. All right. Um, so as far as cut, we'll save the color for next time. As far as cut, what I can do for you today is I can just um, take off the ends that I don't think any treatment is going to help. I can take off uh, all the parts that are sort of ready to go. Yeah, ready to go. Um, is there a certain length you wouldn't want me to chop past? All right, so we're thinking about, okay, way up here. Yeah, see, it's already falling on your face. Sorry about that. I know your hands are under the um, cover. I'm trying to get that behind your ears for side. So, your hair is looking quite long. Quite long. Um, I'm thinking, let's see, maybe about, I'm thinking maybe um, around four inches. How does that sound? Maybe a little bit more, maybe a little bit less. We'll just have to see. That sounds okay. Great, 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 great. Yeah. No hair is beyond repair. Remember that. No hair is beyond repair. No hair is beyond repair. So I'm 
definitely going to be able to help you today. Don't worry. All right, and let me, we also like to check the proportions of the face. We like to be thorough. Just, okay, very good. Okay, and good. Alright, perfect. Yeah, we've started this new program where they want us to record our clients' facial proportions and sort of what haircut they prefer and of course what we would recommend and what they end up liking the best at the end of the day. Some sort of research project. So anyways, if you're good with about four inches, I think I can go ahead and get started on the cut, okay? What I'm going to do first is I'm just going to wet, or actually I'm going to brush your hair. You know, it gets a little bit harder to um, detangle once it's wet. And then I'll go in with a leave-in um, spray shampoo, okay? Alright, first I'm going to give it a good brush, alright? And your chair is already uh, tilted back um, where it needs to be and sort of level adjusted. So I apologize if you're looking at the bottom half of my face for um, the majority of your visit. But this is right where I need you. Let me know if you are uncomfortable at any point, if you need me to itch your nose, maybe, or if your hair is in front of your face and you need a little tuck behind the ear. All right. All right. So I'm going to start with this side. And of course, I'm going to start at the ends. And I can tell that definitely did brush your hair today, but it is so dry and damaged. I think that it became tangled again uh, quite quickly. I know the rain and the wind doesn't help. the back. This side. Okay, start at the ends once again. really fast. 
I can definitely tell that you brushed it before arriving, which is great. I'll save just a little bit of time. A little bit of time. So I'm going to grab a comb to make sure I've gotten most of those tangles. Sometimes they can hide from the brush. There we go. With a little tangle. Down here. Okay. Right. And now the other side. I think we're just about done. Okay. Yep. All right, now I'm going to go in and just wet your hair and spray a little bit of the leaves in shampoo. It's just going to get a little bit of the oil out. Your hair doesn't look too oily, so I think that's all we will need for today. Over to the side.
let me just get some more water it's just going to dilute the shampoo just enough where we can finger comb it out of your hair okay just run that through your hair feels a little better. This will be a lot less drying than a regular wash and shampoo. Let's just get that excess oil out. All right. Now let me give your hair another comb while it's wet. Okay. And what side do you part? your hair on. Okay. Once I get up there to your scalp, I'll go ahead and do that. So your hair looks even whenever you part it. That does make a little bit of a difference. You got some tangles. When I say the water makes it a little worse. Almost got it out here. It's a little stubborn. Okay. This one big tangle. That's how you can tell it's time for a haircut. The tangles just start. does tend to really dry out the ends of your hair. It's very hard to manage. I know celebrities make it look very easy to maintain blonde. It's very hard on our hair. Okay. I think we're just about done with this side. Okay. Go ahead and move on to over here. Just gonna untuck this from behind your ear. Sorry about that. is a little less tingly than the other side. Okay. Right. Get the back 
your head. Just getting the back here. Oh, look, there's a tinkle. There's a tinkle right there. Oh, good. All right. about got it finished here so your part is about right there okay all right here we go okay so now we can go ahead and get cutting. Still good with four inches? Okay. We can miss this thing. your hair is already pretty much almost all the way dry okay okay I'll tuck your hair back for you there okay So to section your hair off today, I'm going to be using a combination of clips as well as these little velcro pads, okay? So these I'll just put on your hair quite, and they're not real vel velcro, okay? They're very uh, gentle. They're almost like the soft side of velcro so easily they come apart so it's not gonna hurt okay and they work extremely well okay I'm just going to take this section and get it out and then velcro back these other sections And I'll clip back this whole side to make sure it doesn't get in your face while I'm cutting. You have a little bit of a view. Okay, so let me go ahead and start with this long section here. Just a little piece. Right. Right. Ready? About right there. Good, good. The first cut is made. Okay. We're going to take a little bit more. Okay, I'm just going to line it up. Okay. Just look 
how much healthier this looks. Okay. I'm just going to keep taking sections here. Work my way to the side just a little bit. Okay. 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 Very good. It's looking gorgeous. It has that freshly cut. Here, feel. That off your face there. Okay. So I'm going to un- See, the Velcro doesn't hurt, right? Alright, I'm going to take a little bit more hair. In here. Easy peasy. Okay. And a few stragglers here. I'm going to let some of this front part go so you make sure it's even on all sides of your head, okay? I'm going to start towards the back here, alright? So I'm just going to keep combing and snipping, making sure I stay
All right. all done. Looks so much healthier. You look at that. So much straighter. All your split ends, gone. Perfect. Okay, so now I'm going to un- is going to be in your face for just one second, okay? All right, can you tilt your head forward for me? the rest of this side, okay? Take this section here. Beautiful. Right, some stragglers. Okay, another section here. Okay. Continue. I need to. this section back. Okay. And one more. Here we go. Okay. in your face again. Sorry about that. Okay.
All right, let's take a look here. Okay. Right, perfect. Your hair already looks so much healthier. So much healthier. So let me put a little bit of leave-in cream just to give a little bit of moisture boost back to your hair, okay? And I'm going to be using something from our premium collection today and you're welcome to purchase it up front if you would like. No pressure. No pressure. It is very nice though. Okay. Alright, and I'm going to also, if you're okay with this, give you a little bit of curl before you leave today just to help get it out of your face, 
Okay, I'm gonna give you a little bit of texture. That way it won't hang right here. It'll hang a little bit off to the side, okay? And that'll be the last thing we do today. And I am going to put a heat protectant on there. This is also from our premium collection. So if you'd like to purchase, you can up front, but no pressure, okay? I'm going to cover your eyes. Okay, the little does go a long way with this product, which is very nice. Okay. Right, just run that through your hair. It's a not a very lightweight product, so really it's better to just use a little. It does smell very nice though. That smells like a hair salon, so that's always nice. Okay. Alright, and I'm just going to give you a little bit of a wave. Turn the straightener on here, and you'll just hear a small noise, okay? Okay, we just have to wait a few seconds. I'm going to use a very low heat, and of course, we already have the blowout spray on your hair. So, there shouldn't be a lot of damage, okay? I can already see your hair looks happier, you know? I'm sure once we get the drape off and you have... That's ready. And you have a feel, you'll feel how much healthier it already um, is and it'll be easier to detangle as well. I'm going to go back here and go ahead and give you a few little waves, okay? Okay. I am using a straightener, but a straightener is a great way to get just a little wave in your hair. Um, it's a little bit less, uh, maybe cumbersome than a curling iron, and this gives a little bit more of a natural wave. And of course, this is cordless as well, so that really helps. Especially with hair as long as yours.
just a little bit of a curl. Sorry, bumped to the air just a little. And this is just preheating the section. One more piece here for this side. Right, that side is done. Okay, I'm just going to do your other side, okay? Okay. Let's see here. I'm just going to do your other side. Let me start at the back. Okay. Close to the front here.
my way to the front here. Just about finished. And we're gonna get this last little Here we go. Okay. There we go. Gorgeous. That is going to be so much easier. For you to manage. Let me just turn this off. Okay. All right. So, yes, this is going to be so much easier for you to manage, so much easier for you to wash. <laughs> and maybe next time, if we just give the color a break for this appointment. Um, we'll be able to talk about doing something next time. Okay. Does that sound good? Okay. Perfect. Well, thank you for coming in today. I don't hear too much rain outside, so hopefully, um, your hair won't get messed up on the way to your car. And... I'll see you in a couple of weeks, okay? Okay, have a good rest of your evening.